Hey everyone, welcome back to the Gamer Sphere of weekly video game editorials, news, and gameplay. So, another quick update on my plans to stream Final Fantasy XIV on this channel. This will be the final update before actually streaming Final Fantasy XIV. For those of you who missed it, I will be regularly streaming XIV on this channel going forward as my live stream default game and decided to dedicate a day to streaming it for about one to two hours on top of my usual Sunday live stream. The live stream day for Final Fantasy XIV will be Saturdays. Uh, I posted a poll on YouTube and Twitter and most of you voted by a margin that 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time will be the most convenient time to tune in. So until otherwise notified, the Final Fantasy XIV live stream time going forward will be every Saturday at 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time for one to two hours here on YouTube. I'm going to push for two hours each stream since this is a really important game and A Realm Reborn will require a bit of a grind. Uh, and also don't forget that if no other games are being streamed during the normal Sunday game stream, uh, gameplay live stream, we will be streaming Final Fantasy XIV on Sundays as well. So there will be weekends that we may get through six something hours of Final Fantasy XIV. As I mentioned before, I've already poured 25 something hours of gameplay into A Realm Reborn, but mostly from side quests. So we'll be starting from scratch to document our journey as a Lalafell Lancer in the realm of New Gridania. And our focus will be to plow through the MSQ and finish A Realm Reborn as quickly as possible. The first live stream will be this Saturday, April 10th at 9 p.m. Pacific Standard Time here on YouTube. We are still playing Bravely Default 2 during the Sunday live streams, and by the time that we finish, I suspect that Near Replicant will most likely be out, and that will be like the new Sunday live stream going forward. So Final Fantasy XIV, at least for the foreseeable future, will be a Saturday live stream game, and giving it its own separate dedicated time slot will ensure that it will constantly be on the radar. So please join the live stream if you can this Saturday. Feel free to back backseat, critique, criticize, hustle me along, whatever it takes to get to Heaven's Ward as quickly as possible. The first stream will probably be just for about an hour, mostly to get through setup and intro. I am migrating from a PS5 DualSense controller to an actual mouse and keyboard, so there may be a little bit of a re-familiarizing with the controls, hopefully not much, but the schedule has been set, the new equipment is ready, the subscription renewed, and we have a green light and all things are a go. Some other quick updates while on the topic of live streaming, don't forget that April 15, 3 p.m. is the Resident Evil Showcase, where we'll be getting some news on Resident Evil Village and more, so they say. I will be live streaming that event as well. A gameplay demo for Resident Evil Village has already been uploaded onto PSN, not live yet, but four new SKUs have been detected for the United States, Japan, Europe, and Asia. The demo is roughly 10 gigabytes large and looks to be a full-out gameplay demo instead of the visual showcase maiden demo. With Village less than 30 days away from launch, I suspect that they'll also shadow drop the new demo after the event, which we will be live streaming for sure. Village is one of those special games, as I mentioned. Just another heads up, I will be releasing a few Final Fantasy 16 related videos in the coming weeks as well. One of them related to Forspoken, which was revealed at the Sony Presents Spring Showcase. I'm sorry, the Square Enix uh, Presents Spring Showcase and another kind of bigger picture video on Final Fantasy 16. E3 this year will be a digital event again. Uh, June 15th, but Sony will apparently be absent, so any Final Fantasy 16 official news will most likely be revealed at another Square Presents event in the summer, like the one we got in March. So in the meantime, we might do another Final Fantasy 16 live stream where we'll be going over the official website again. Just to recap, it's always a good idea to go back on details that were potentially missed. I will continue to live stream on YouTube. I think I may have worked out the live stream suspension issues that I had from several streams ago, though circumstances may force me to move to Twitch in the future as well. Uh, or actually, let me know in the comments if YouTube or Twitch is your go-to platform for watching streamers, or if it doesn't really make any difference either way. But that is the update for now. As always, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you find these videos helpful or entertaining. Just like if not. And thank you to everyone who's weighed in on the polls and joined in on the live streams. Most definitely, I guarantee we will have twice as much fun with the addition of Final Fantasy XIV as I will most likely be commenting the hell out of it as we move through it. So for you Final Fantasy XIV veterans out there, feel free to tune in to get some insight from someone looking at the game with fresher eyes. So look forward to that and until Saturday, which is probably tomorrow by the time you see this video, stay tuned and take care.